So welcome to one more video of King Pog's useful tips and today we're going to do how to draw King Pog at last. So this is going to be in sketches as well, by the way, which is a very good drawing app. So first we start off with a uh, main head shape of what kind of looks like an upside down egg but with a flat bottom. Well, flat top. Um, and then we move on to the ears, which are big and floppy because it looks royal. Then the crown, reasonably tall, and with three pointy bits on top. And then the nose, in the exact centre of the face. And then a dog mouth coming out, as you do. And then the eyes, which are ovals, um, with the pupils inside them. The pupils can be facing in whichever way you want, but I like to do it facing up in the corner for some reason. It just looks nice. And then... Um, you can do the little balls on top of the crown, which are a nice detail. You don't have to add them, but I think it just looks nice. And then the crystals in the on the crown. One big one in the middle and two smaller ones on the sides. Then you can do little freckles if you like, but I don't do it that often. But you can if you want. And last but not least, the tongue. Just a small little tongue sticking out. And then um, now we colour it in. So the middle gem on the crown um, is red. I mean, you can make this whatever colour you like, but this is, this is how I do it. And by the way, this is for the newest version of King Pog, not the one on my channel icon. That's the original. So, the red gem in the centre, then the two gems on either side are green, so they're emeralds, and the middle one is ruby. Yeah, it's a bit messy, but if you're doing it in sketches, then you can use the fill tool to make it look nice and professional and smooth which I think looks much nicer and then um, the crown colour it's gold so you can just use yellow and add a little grey, greyish tint which looks nice and also the filter is always a quicker way that makes it look nice much neater and nicer because yeah it's just quicker as well so and then the face it's a shade of brown not too, not too dark but not too light either it's kind of and not too red. If you just darken orange, then, then you'll get the right brown. That's a bit too dark. Um, yeah, I think that'll be about right. Yeah, there we go, that's perfect. Then make sure you colour the ears as well. Um, right, so now the pink tongue, we just want, if you just get like a fuchsia pink and then make it a bit paler, and we're done. So today we did how to draw King Pog, and don't forget to subscribe, and... 
I'll see you soon.